Hello friends, I am Nashik from blog2.com and today in this video, I'll show you the fastest and the most easiest method to clone your website from one domain to another domain. So let's jump right into it. Now, what you have to do, you have to simply open a new tab and just go to your cPanel link. So if you don't know your cPanel link, simply type in your website name, put a forward slash and type in cPanel. Okay, so this will redirect you to cPanel or enter your username and password and click on login. If you don't remember your username and password, just go check your inbox. This, you know, whenever you create a hosting account, a new hosting account, they send you an email. In that, you have all your username and password. So simply go ahead and check out that. Okay. Now, first of all, let me show you one thing. So this is the website. Let me refresh this so that no one will think that I'm tricking someone. Now, as you can see, this is the website that I'll be cloning or duplicating. Okay, so let me show you this website. This is this complete website. Really nice and beautiful website. And this is the domain test.nashek.com. Let me refresh this. As you can see, there is nothing over here. Let me refresh it again. It's a blank website. So there is nothing over here. In this website, we have so many pages. As you can see, we have WooCommerce installed. We have different products and so on. But if you see how you will just see how you know small time this takes to copy your website from one domain to another now first of all let me tell you one thing you can do this only if your hosting provider supports this thing softaculous app installer so tmd hosting which is using uh, which is i am using right now and which is the hosting that i you know use on all my websites so TMD supports that. I think SiteGround and A2 hosting also supports Softaculous app installer. So just for find out whether your hosting company supports that or not. If it does not support, uh, unfortunately, you just have to stop here. You cannot watch this video. But if you have some good hosting company like TMD and SiteGround, then you can just continue with this video. The second thing is that you can do this only if both the domains are hosted on the same server. For example, dropship dot uh, dropship me dot dot com and test dot dot com are both hosted on this cpanel on this server okay so this is the second thing if you want to you know copy your website from one domain to another domain and if you don't have this softaculous and if you and both your domains are hosted on different servers you can simply go to youtube and type in this thing that i'm going to show you right now and you will see a video that will help you. So go to YouTube and type in Nayashik and Nayashik website transfer. Something like this should show that video. Let me see. Oh, as you can see, this is the video Nayashik website transfer. The second one, how to migrate website quick and easy. Okay. How to migrate WordPress website from one domain to another domain. Okay. And server. So if you don't have Softaculous app installer and if both the domains are hosted on different uh, companies or different hosting uh, service providers, you can watch that video, this one. Okay. But if you have this Softaculous installer and if both the domains are installed and hosted on the same server, you can follow my steps. Okay. Now let's click on WordPress. Now, as you can see, this is dropship.me. So what I'll have to do is I'll have to scroll down. I'll see all the uh, WordPress that I have installed over here. I'll have to find for dropship.me, which is over here. As you can see, dropship.me. I'll have to click on this icon, which says clone. So let's click on that. Now I'll have to select the domain where I want to copy this. So this domain is test.nashek.com. So I'll simply select test not this one yeah this one test.nashik.com as you can see i'll select https and i in directory i'll just delete this wp okay now rest all we don't have to touch just leave everything scroll down and click on clone installation now let's count one two three four five six seven no, within 10 seconds, as you can see, your website is completely cloned. Now, let me do one thing. Let me refresh this website again. Now, as you can see, we have the exact same website. All the products, everything is present over here. Let me go to some different page. As you can see, the shop page, everything is, you know, installed and copied from one place to another. Now, you can go to your, you know, C panel. You can go to your dashboard. Let's see whether that works or not. Let me log in. 
Now, as you can see, it completely works. All the plugins, all the themes that are installed are all cloned. Okay. So I hope this video was helpful. This was a very quick video, but I think, you know, I recently figured it out. So I think this is really cool for someone like me. It saves a lot of time. Okay. So I, I think, you know, it might help you as well. Okay. So if you find this video helpful, give a thumbs up to this video, subscribe to my channel and also click on that bell icon so they don't miss any future videos. If you have any doubt, any suggestions, any comments for me, you can leave them in the comment section below. Thanks a lot for watching guys. See you soon.